Okay, hey guys, it is JP with another video. What? So soon. It's crazy, I know. Um, so this video is just me drawing this random thing. I'm actually going to play a little bit of my game while this is going. Okay, so I was drawing earlier, two hours ago, and I was like, hey, why don't I just record this and show a small video just to, you know, get you guys, uh, get you guys popping and interested in, uh, getting my, uh, my channel views up because I love getting my channel views up. It helps so much for me to get advice from you guys and, um, yeah, so, <laughs> Um, since you haven't, I haven't gotten any comments on what you guys would like to see, I decided to just draw random stuff like I always do. So right now, um, what you can see me doing is just kind of drawing the background. Um, ah, yeah, that is, that's mostly what's going on there. Um, I like to start with the background first because it kind of gives me like, what is this, what, give, what is the taste of this whole thing going to be? Like, what is it, is it going to be awesome? Like, of course it's going to be awesome, but you know, I don't know, I'm not being like that. <laughs> um, but I guess, uh, while that's going, cause, um, that, that part's kind of self-explanatory. Everything else though, um, maybe we can, we can talk about some of the stuff that I got going on, so... Um, I've been practicing my guitar a whole lot. Um, 15 minutes a day. Woohoo! Yeah. Wish me luck, guys. <laughs> I also, uh, been looking into uh, the type of genre of music I'm going to be doing. I know it's not going to be one because the type of stuff that I like to sing and listen to are slightly different. So, um, I know that, uh, what I'm going to be doing is just doing a whole lot of nailing down my research and uh, really seeing what kind of music I'm trying to bring to the table that's new and unique. Um, but yeah, I've been getting a lot of that going on right now, today, yesterday. Um, right now, I'm putting a base color down for the skin, uh, just kind of a random one. Uh, I didn't know what her skin tone was going to be completely, but I knew what it had a mix of, if that makes any sense. So started doing that. And then, um, yeah, I just, with that one skin tone, I just started hitting all the darks. And then, uh, I put my main skin tone on later, um, the lightest skin tone of it later and just kind of blend later with that. And I do a lot of stuff later, don't I? <laughs> now and later. Just can call me a candy. Just call me in candy and that'll be this guy. Um Yeah. Man. My my like lips are like so dry right now. They're not dry. It's like what? I don't know. It's weird. Um and the game I'm playing, it's actually called Disgaea. I don't know if you've ever heard of it anybody who's watching this it's like Dissidia Sky or something I don't know it's D-I-S-G-A-E-A -A. you get to make your own like characters and stuff and level them up and do like a bunch of damage and uh it's just so time consuming it's bad but it's good I just can't stop um but yeah guys that's that is that is what's up that is what's on the hop and hop um, do, 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 uh, later on, I fixed some of the line work. I thought I was going to work on the line work a little bit more than I did, but I didn't because that laziness thing came in. So yeah, I need to get rid of that laziness thing. Um, but yeah, uh, at the end of it, I, I really like how it turned out. I just wish that I could speed up the video faster because I know, uh, not everybody likes to look at the 27 minute videos like this guy. I love him. Mm, give me that 27 minute video. Nah. Um, I think this practice that I did um, was really good because uh, I got to learn the program a little bit more. I figured out that's part of my issue. 
I don't know the program as well as I would like to. And so because of that, some of my images on digital art lack, um, you know, the real feeling or the real image that I'm trying to put out. Um, and speaking of which, I actually am thinking of making a traditional video for you guys. Um, because I got my sketchbook over here and, uh, I think it'd be really cool if I get you guys some type of, uh, some type of traditional thing. Because I think a lot of you maybe, um, aren't viewing it because you see all this digital and, uh, you only have a traditional to work with, which that's okay. That's perfect. I do traditional all the time. Like I'll even show you, um, coming up pretty soon all this uh all the traditional stuff that i do and all the practice i do outside of digital um i practice a whole lot um and you know the goal behind practicing is um what your goal is uh my goal is really to self-promote myself so i can um make a lot of different things that uh I really love enjoy doing. <laughs> I'm getting distracted because I'm looking at what my screen's doing. It looks like there's like a smart focus on there and stuff. Um, but yeah, I I uh, I mostly draw things that I envision in my mind, stories that I have in my head, and uh, that's what keeps me training more and trying to get get my art up, get those art skills up, mm, power up, anyways, um, right now, that's me just, uh, messing with the eyes, trying to make it some type of appealing color with the hair, but what, uh, kind of got in the way is the fact that I didn't know what color the hair was gonna be, so, I was like, oh, great, now we're doing everything topsy-turvy, okay, all right, okay, all right, <laughs> no, um, so, yep, I made the eyes blue and later on I'm like I made the eyes blue now I need to match it up with some type of other blue I don't know if that came first or if the scarf came first I don't want to give too much away just in case you want to see the rest of the video and stuff and see how that all came about happening um right there I'm using the same technique that I did with the skin I'm just nailing down a kind of medium color I'm hitting the darkest and then I'm going for lights on the top um keeping a i keep i'm slightly keeping an eye on where the light's coming from but not a lot <laughs> i really should uh do that more i kind of do like a main light that's coming from one direction instead of just like a light that's probably the next thing i'll do on another video uh hopefully i'll do a traditional video next time but if not that i'll try to do a ooh. If not that, I'll try to do a um, a video on e i o. I'll try to do a video on uh, light coming from another side and me just training with it, because I'm sure I can do it. But I guess we'll just find out how well I can do it. Um, right there, I think I went back to the skin because uh i missed a spot right there i really wish i kept that tone right there because i think i messed it up at the end of the video i don't know <laughs> um but it's okay if i do it's okay it's just you know it's good practice i'm just watching it realizing some of the mistakes i made the line work i kind of fixed that towards the end of the video but i could have did a little bit of better job I need to figure out how um, my style of line work is really going to work out for me because, um, yeah, it needs a little bit of work, just a tad bit, just a little bit, but uh, I'm pretty sure I can nail it out. Just got to focus hard and do my best. That's all you can do, guys. You can do more than just your best. You can give it all. I believe in every single one of you guys. Everybody who's watching this video. I actually believe in uh, everybody. I feel like we all have uh, greatness inside of us, but sometimes different experiences kind of keep us from hitting our max potential. 
to where we don't really believe in ourselves. That's kind of kind of the problem I have sometimes. Uh, other people kind of didn't believe in like uh, different things that I wanted to do, and I realized really late in the game that I could do it if I just put my mind to it. So it's just like yeah, can't let them can't let them uh, tell you otherwise. Once you know what you want to do. You do it all the way, 100%, 110%. Because later on, you can give it a good two years, just like I gave my art a good two years, and I'm somewhere I never thought I would be with it, but I'm still not um, at that level, but I never thought I could take it as far as I did because there was a lot of people saying, like, ah, well, you know, you're switching off and on what you want to do and stuff. And it's like, yeah, because I'm still trying to find me, you know, and... I did find me through these. I found myself through art. I uh, really did. Uh, I can honestly say that if you learn a different, um, if you learn a different medium, some type of like music or anything, and you, it's something you have to work hard to achieve. I can be a person who can tell you that you will find yourself in it, no matter what it is. And the next time you do something, it'll be almost a hundred times the effect because you just you're completely mastering yourself like I'm picking up another language and I'm through picking up other languages I'm realizing more of myself and uh, who I am so um, I'm a little bit more confident with what I'm doing the direction I'm going um, can't say I'm completely where I want to be as far as my confidence and completely where I want to be as far as the direction I'm going, but I'm taking steps towards it and that's the best that you can do instead of just kind of sitting there and like, oh, if I do it, I'll probably mess up and da da da. Nah, you got to believe enough. And every time I make a video, guys, this is me believing in myself that I can, uh, I can, uh, <laughs> get a nice little community up here and have you guys coming into uh coming into my channel every week they enjoy that um it gets back to the video huh let me see so i guess i'm just putting in the highlights for the hair i wanted to try something kind of slightly different um with the hair what i did was da -da -da -da. um I colored, where did I color? I colored it kind of a light blue at the top, so you still knew that the light was hitting. I didn't really do it too well because the light would be hitting in the front bangs as well, but eh. Um, I don't know if I fixed that. I may fix that later. I don't know if I did. Um, but that's probably one thing that I just noticed that I didn't do. And um, what else? Jeez, I'm just taking a taking myself apart on this man um so then uh those are the purple bangs i kind of made i kind of wanted to dip it in sugar kind of stuff <laughs> you know how you sometimes you'll see uh the bangs are a little bit light coming up and stuff i'm still experimenting on how to do that the correct way but for now i kind of just make it as if the hair itself was kind of dyed that way I like it. I like the tips. It's kind of cute. Hmm. Right there, I'm just making them even because I noticed that the tips were kind of like fat because I was, uh, what was I doing? Because I decided, oh, yeah. Let's just use the opacity brush for everything. But then I realized that there's different brushes and different tools for different things. And I really shouldn't just stick to one thing. So I end up uh, doing my best on that and uh, kind of squeeze those those pieces in, trying to make it a little bit better. I guess um, we talked about the drawing for a little bit, so... Let's uh let's talk about something else now for a little bit and we'll kinda switch off and on. Um so the next thing that I guess I'll talk about is uh I some of the experiences I was doing. 
to try to get uh, get y'all involved. Uh, so I went on my Davian art and I posted all the videos, not all the videos, the most current ones and stuff. Posted them there and uh, tried to see if anybody would come over and check out my YouTube channel, which I believe some of you did. And if you did, thank you very much. Um, but uh, I'm I'm hoping that you guys kind of tell your friends to check out my channel. And if you have any advice, like please let me know because uh, I cannot get better at this unless I get some critique. Uh, um, this is an art channel, and critique is okay. Just don't be a rude guy. Don't be like, ah, oh, well, first thing you can do is eat a fish. Mm-hmm. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, I said it. But, uh, you know, if you were a guy who says that, I would just say that I did eat fish earlier. So I guess that completes the task. Does that make me better? No. <laughs> um, I don't know. I need to write down stuff to talk about whenever I'm on this. Because, like, sometimes it's like, what? What are you talking about, Julian? Come on, bro. Oh, yeah, I don't know if you guys noticed by now, but, like, I fixed the nose. Uh, the nose it doesn't look bad. And when I was fixing it, I thought I was making it look bad. <laughs> but it actually looks better at the end. So I was like, eh, okay. So taking risks is not all bad, guys. I'm, I'm taking risks every single time I'm drawing. It's freaking ridiculous. It's like, oh, my gosh. Um, right there. Ah, oh, man, I'm so sorry. Uh, so whenever I did the goggles, I did it on a separate la layer because it was completely separate from anything that comes outside of the skin. Um, the hair grows from the skin, so I use the same color as the skin base color. Um, I used uh, basically everything. Uh, I really should have made the scarf a different color, but uh, I think I blended with those. But really, anything that was skin related, I kept it the same um the bra that didn't really work the sports bra that didn't work out as well as i wanted to those boobs aren't even uh i wish those boobs were a little bit more even but eh, you know shoulda woulda coulda um yeah i should have made a little bit there, there's a whole bunch of stuff, stuff i should have did but you know this is this is why watching my work is making me a little bit uh it's a little bit better Hmm. So, let's try to see what else I got going on here. If I can. Okay, so that's me just drawing in the tattoo. I had some line work for the tattoo, but I was uh, that wasn't working out very well. So I was like, uh, okay, I can do tattoos. I didn't know, but symbols and stuff like that, I could do them. Uh, I was really shocked and surprised. I found this out like three or four days ago when I was playing around. Cause I used to, people used to come up to me and be like, hey, like when you're an artist, everybody thinks you can draw like everything. So they're like, hey, can, can, can draw, draw this tattoo, man. And I'm like, uh, I don't draw tattoos. I draw everything but tattoos. It's like, oh, no, no, it's okay. I'm going to put it on my skin, like, in, like, two days. It's, like, my tattoo. I'm like, what the, f what, what, are you, what are you talking about? <laughs> no, I'm not, I am not going to draw a tattoo for you so you can put on your skin and be pissed off at me later. Be like, where is this guy? Where is the guy that drew this? Looking on DeviantArt, hunting me down, just pacing in his room, like, oh man, I'm gonna find him. I am going to find this J JP Pierre man. He's he's going down, man. I'll be like, I'll never be able to like come out of my room because I'll be scared of that dude. I'll be like, man, this is this is stupid. Why, why, why did I do that tattoo for him? I knew I shouldn't have done it. I knew, I knew. Oh man, I keep skipping parts. Um, so this is this is um. Ooh, yay! I found the item I'm looking for. Anyways, um, this is the. So I guess you missed it. So the scarf. Um, what I did was just get a light purple that kind of blent in with her bangs, and uh, her hair. I wanted everything to kind of look like it matched and belong together, because I almost made a character out of it. So. 
She kind of looks like Kill a Kill now that I think about it, but I didn't look at any references for Kill a Kill, so it may have been able to look a little bit more like her if I did. Eh, eh, eh. Kill a Kill is my anime, though. I, I love it. Don't lose your way. Yeah. That didn't happen. You didn't enjoy that. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. Anyways, what else do we got going on here? Ah. So there, I am just uh, messing with the... Because I didn't want to go over... The video was already running really long. And uh, I'm trying to get it under two hours. Which I actually made this in an hour and... Uh, 52 minutes so i'm cutting it down a little bit yay woohoo um but yeah that was that was mostly what i was trying to mess with that was uh i was trying to get that line work in even though it's not completely good the color kind of makes up for it so and uh, you may not be able to see it i did it too quick but uh, a lot of the color i actually um what did i do a lot of the color, um, that's not even what I'm trying to say. Uh, one of, in a moment inside the video, I actually take off the whole thing with the color. So, um, but I don't think you notice it because I do it really quick. And there, I'm just uh, hitting the robot, not hitting it, literally. I'm sure you knew that though. Um, if you didn't, that's weird. Um, <laughs> Uh, and I'm trying to get a tone, a color, a skin. I didn't want it to be exactly the same, but I wanted it to be something that kind of matched with the uh, scarf that she had to kind of show that they kind of interact with each other and work together. I really should have made the eyes light blue or the goggles light green. Now I'm thinking about it, I should have made the goggles light green so it kind of matches with the robot's goggles. So it kind of looks like they interact with each other. Like as soon as she puts on the glove, the goggles, then you see -doo 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 -doo, and it's like Iron Man screen and stuff. And it's like, whoa, I've been a, I'm learning now. So you know, I'm learning from my mistakes here. Um, What else we got going on? I'm going to be messing with that background a little bit too. As soon as I get comfortable with this line work that I got going on. Because that background, I was going to make it really epic. I was going to be like, whoa, it's such a vast, amazing world. Because I told y'all, if you watched my other videos, I told y'all a while ago, like, man, like, backgrounds are my thing. Um, but, uh, uh, yeah, I was, I was uh, trying to cut down the time and stuff, so I didn't mess with that background as much as I thought. Here I go, uh, messing with it now. What I tried to do was just throw in some different textures and see where I was trying to go with it. Because I looked up a... I, I like drawing slums and stuff. Like cities and slums. Like ghettos and stuff. Kind of making it look like a rural area. Um, so I looked up Paris slums. Paris ghettos. And I came up with an interesting shape. But uh, I, I spent too much time on the drawing. So like this is is when I'm starting to get tired out and I was like oh man I wasn't completely tired out but it was just me thinking about how long the video was and stuff like that and I just didn't end up uh, doing all the stuff that I was trying to do on it so I had to look at her for a little bit and be like so what would be in, in the background with her where would she be and as I was thinking that, I put another interesting tattoo on her because I thought her skin was a little bit too, like it didn't have enough on there. I wanted uh, something robotic. So you can tell that she's like in, a, in the future, but in the wasteland. I could have added a lot more to her as far as character design stuff, but that wasn't really what I was going for, mostly. This was mostly, I would say this practice was to figure out the program more because I knew a couple of cool techniques for skin and stuff like that, but I really didn't know the program as well as I would like to. So this is, that's me just struggling, struggling to get this program working. Mm -hmm, work, work, working. So now, um, 
I guess I'm fixing that on there. I think I went back to fix the skin. So this is me fixing the nose. Part way into this, I'm like, oh man, I'm breaking it. I'm I'm breaking it. I'm gonna be so mad. And this thing doesn't let me go back that far. So oh my gosh, like rah, 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 rah. I was I was freaking out, but it's all right. I think we uh ooh, what's it doing? I think uh, we did a pretty good job. Decent, decent job. I keep filling in actual words with maps. Mm. Would you like some maps? Oh. Well, here you go, Sonny boy. Ooh, I need to stop that. So, what else are we doing? That I was trying to do a little bit, mm, a little bit on the skin, on the lips. Now that I'm looking at it, I missed a spot on the erasing of the line work. So yay, Julian, you did a great job. I mean, JP, <laughs> darn it, guys, you gotta, you gotta make sure I don't slip up on that. Be like it's JP, okay? It's JP. Um, yeah, you know. Hopefully you guys are watching this. I hope you watched it all the way through. If you did, I thank you so much. Like, and please don't forget to leave a comment because I really enjoyed making these videos. I just wish I knew the people that were watching it. I wanted to, I want to talk with y'all just like, yeah, Be like, hey, you like my video? What do you like about it? What do you like? What do you like hearing? Do you like hearing sandwiches? Cause we make sandwiches, we do them. We do them all day. Sandwich day, hump day. Okay, don't say that. I think that's copyrighted. Anyways, um, oh yeah, I forgot this. So here I am, putting in color. I'm I'm smearing everything in basically, cause I'm like, uh, okay, we need to fix this. So everything I'm basically um, e. I oh, not that. Everything I'm kind of blending into each other, and then later on I'm gonna brighten up a couple of edges in the area. Cause I was telling you I wanted to make a really epic background, but I was running out of time as far as how much I wanted to do this on there. So, um, I ended up uh, I ended up just blending all the background on there. Not proud of it, but hey, uh, not proud of, you know, hitting the background weird, but, uh, gotta try my, gotta try my best next time. Try to get you guys a full image of what I was thinking in the time limit that we need it done in. It's like every, every, every day now. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Yeah, so I was gonna sing to you guys too. Um, not now, but you know, later. Really feel like singing now. But I know I was supposed to be making a singing video for you guys too, so um, I'm gonna figure out what song I wanna do a cover on and figure out how to make sure I don't get sued for doing covers. I think I just gotta say well, who the song, who made it in the description and then uh show you guys how uh how i sing because i sing all the time in the videos but i don't really show you guys like my real voice and stuff like that so i think that'll be interesting to do uh oops uh so i guess we're getting towards the end of the video Oh, wow. That was quick. Um, well, guys, thank you very much for watching another video with me. Uh, this is JP. Love you guys. Don't forget to uh, like and subscribe if you really like the video. And uh, I love y'all. Bye.